we're essentially drinking our clothes. Every time we wash a piece of synthetic clothing, tiny threads are released with every wash, and these threads are so small and made of plastic themselves, they pass right through any filtration systems and they end up in our waterways. They collect all different types of toxins on their surfaces and then they're ultimately ending up on our plates. So it's really important to do this research to figure out exactly how much are being released and the best ways to then capture them. Consumers are wanting to know what they're consuming. They want to know more about the environmental impact of their choices. And that's kind of why we really want this detection process, so we can have a certification to say, you know, this product has so many microplastics in it, or hopefully, this product is plastic free. It's certainly different being one of the few female founders in the ecosystem, but if I had done my studies at any other university, I don't know if there's that same innovative entrepreneurial network that we see with the University of Waterloo and their connection to Velocity. Entrepreneurship and pitching was never on my radar at all as anything that I'd ever do. It can be really daunting for sure when you don't see anybody like you doing this yet, but I feel like we're in the position to go into the space and maybe be those role models down the road. So hopefully I can encourage other folks to get involved and then they can in turn be role models themselves.